threes over here. That's because in three of those city council races, three candidates are vying for the spot and you need 50% of the vote to clinch. Now, both here in Gulf Shores, as well as in Orange Beach, the city council positions are at large positions, meaning you don't have people running for specific districts because the cities are too small for that. Instead, candidates run for city council places and voters get to make their choice for each one. Now, both Mayor Robert Kraft here in Gulf Shores and Tony Kennan in Orange Beach have one opponent, but being longtime incumbents, Kraft and Kennan are expected to keep their seats. Now, when it comes to results, city officials will actually be posting the numbers on the doors of each of the polling sites. They're going to be posting them online and on Facebook afterwards. We'll be here both when they post them on the door and be keeping an eye out for all of that website information. And we'll be sure to get that to you guys as soon as it comes our way. Reporting live in Gulf Shores, Brianna Hollis, WKRG News 5. Thank you, Brianna.